Hello, Dani here and welcome to another TBR Char Draw. Um, I finished all the books I drew in my first one so I can continue. So yay, new books. I finished like my comics a long time ago so I was like I need new comics. When can I read new comics? So now that I've finished my book I can do another char draw and get new books to read. So I'm just going to get right into it without explaining. If you want to know exactly how I'm doing this just go on my other one and check it out because I'm explaining why and things are the things they are. So yeah, the first book I'm going to be reading in the next three weeks. For right now it's three weeks I'm doing these videos. In the near future it's going to be whenever I'm finished. Um, but the first book on my TBR for the next few weeks is the second book of the Infernal Devices, uh, Clockwork Prince. It's a body read again. The whole Shadow Hunter thing is a body read, and we read we read a book every three weeks. So we finished uh, City of Fallen Angels. So this is the next one. We're gonna go by publication publication order. So yeah, this is the book for the next three weeks. I'm gonna be drawing another book, but I can't guarantee I'm gonna be finishing that book as well. Usually I would just make a new video once I'm finishing all the books I drew, but since I'm already reading a book, I'm not sure how fast I'm gonna get done with the other book depending on how big it is because I don't know which one it is so I can't tell. Um, but I kind of need something else because I've been reading the Shadow Hunter series for months now and that's all I read from books. So I kind of want to draw another one so I can get something else to read if I want to and have time. So I will be reading that we'll be drawing a book, but I might take it into the next TBR, but I don't know yet, it depends what book it is. So yeah, let's just get to that. As I said, the books are the green ones, so I'm gonna draw a green one. I have to check that I see it's actually green. That one's green, okay. So let's see what that is. It's always looking up, which means it's an autobiography by Michael J. Fox. That will be that. I've been having these books forever. I don't even remember. I think I got it since seven years, eight years. I got it a long, long time ago. I read the first of his books that I was Lucky Man. So I really freaking love Michael J. Fox. I mean, not just because he was in one of my favorite freaking movies of all time, but also because he's really inspiring and everything. So I wanted to read his autobiography. I'm not reading a lot of autobiographies because I'm not really into reading those, but that one was so inspiring. It was so sad. So I got that one as well, but I never got to read it. So now it's... I drew it so I have to read it, which is okay. I'm pretty sure I'll get through this at some point. So yeah, this is my other book. Right, then I decided to draw four comics. So let's get to that. That is going to be the blue ones. So let's see if I get a blue one. Alright, here we go. First one I'm gonna be reading. I'm liking this month already. <laughs> Back to the Future Volume 1. That will be this one. I have already read this in single issues, but I stopped getting the single issues and got the graphic novel, so I wanna reread it. So this is gonna be a reread, but I'm still excited because I freaking love this. If you love Back to the Future, the film, you should read these as well because it's also written by Bob Gale who created Back to the Future and it's a lot of background stories and other stories in the Back to the Future 
verse so it's canon so it's pretty cool and I prefer it like that than having actually a fourth movie because I really don't want, would not want another movie even though I freaking love these films but I do not want another film so I really like the idea of having comics to tell stories you get background, background stories on the characters you get they travel it to other times and all this and it's really interesting and I really love it so I'm happy to reread this again then the next one I'm gonna be reading let's have a blue one here we go so many greens in here and the next one is Harley Quinn welcome to Metropolis that would be this one I have started reading this a while ago but then stopped so I guess I'm getting back into this and finally read it I love Harley Quinn so this is great so yep it's Harley Quinn and Poison Ivy so that is great so that one and this is a fat one so four of those need to read a lot in the next three weeks then the next one would be Miss Marvel Volume 2. That would be that one. I only actually got this a few days ago so I still need to haul it. But I don't have enough comics to haul yet so I'm waiting. But yeah that would be this one Miss Marvel volume 2 generation y i really like the first issue so i'm happy to continue the story and get done with it so i can start a new story and the last comic i'm going to be reading in the next few weeks is come on blue here we go when can i read the flash Outcast Volume 1. That will be this one. This is about a guy named Kyle who is possessed by a demon. So that is right up my alley since Supernatural is like my favorite TV show. So I'm happy to read more Supernatural stuff. So yes, good. Can't wait to dive into this story. So that is it for the comics, so I'm going to draw Hmm, that's a good question, how many mangas should I get with this? Let's say two. Man, I have a lot to read. So now I need yellow. There's not... Damn it, it fell down. There's not a lot of yellow. So I got one. No, Hawkeye fell. Don't fall. Right. The first manga I'm gonna read is Orange Volume 1. Hell yeah, I wanted to read this for a while now. That would be this. This is about a girl who got a letter from herself from the future about some boy she's gonna meet that is gonna be in trouble and she has to like save him this is like tra time travel drama whatever I don't know but I've heard loads and loads and loads of good things of people who've read it so I'm freaking excited to read this it's a freaking huge man how am I gonna read this in three weeks you should all know I'm a slow reader so but yep yeah, orange volume one which means, real quick first, what I have to do is... Put in volume 2 in my chore because I own it. Because chances are I draw this now. Okay. In here, shake it. Right. 
And the last book I'm gonna be reading for this upcoming few weeks is Barakamon Volume 3. That is another book I only just got recently and haven't hauled yet, so I'm reading it before hauling it, that's awesome. So, but yeah, Barakamon Volume 3, excited for this, I freaking love this story, it's so funny and cute and just such a good laugh and it just makes me happy, this story makes me happy. And it's great, and I will read this when I need a cheer up book, so. Right, Barakamon Volume 3. Read this if you haven't. This is freaking awesome. Right, so my TBR for the next three weeks is this. Holy crap, what am I doing to myself? Because Orange is freaking huge. And then there is like the Harley Quinn and it's quite big as well. And then there's two freaking books. So, but as I said, if I'm if three weeks are over and I'm done with this because I need to haul the next book because I need to read the next book in three weeks so I'm gonna be hauling anyway uh, I mean I'm gonna be uh, doing a TBR anyway so if I'm not done looking up, always looking up I will take it into the next TBR video because I can usually I wouldn't do that, I would wait until I've finished all the books since I have a, a, a time a deadline on this one I will have to haul to I'm saying hauling all the time. I will have to do a TBR anyway. So for now, yeah. But here we go. Clockwork Prince, always looking up. Back to the Future, Volume 1. Harley Quinn, Welcome to Metropolis. Miss Marvel, Volume 2. Outcast, Volume 1. Orange, Volume 1. And Barakamon, Volume 3. That is it for this video. Good luck to me for reading all of this. Holy crap. But yep. Let me know what you're reading right now. And what I should read as well. Because I'm always up for suggestions. Especially mangas and comics. But yep. This is it for now. I'm gonna end this video here. Get ready for work. Yay, weekend working. But yeah, anyway, that's it for the video. I'll see you soon. Peace.